Hey YouTube, Catman280 here. And if you don't mind, wait, hold up. I hear this guy coming. Hold up. Get out of my safe space, bruh. Oh man, he just killed me. Okay, guys, so newsflash. This game from from now on, I'm gonna be calling it Modern Safe Space Warfare. Even though this game is clearly called Modern Warfare. This game to, to me, it really doesn't even feel like Modern Warfare. It actually feels like Ghost 2. They just slapped Modern Warfare on it because they knew the thing would freaking sell. But anyway, uh, this video is basically going to be me just talking about why I'm playing the way I play in this game. Why I pretty much got to play like a little wuss in this game. Because Infinity War decided to make this game all about safe spaces. And if you guys don't believe me, check out this little clip of why... I now call this modern safe space warfare. Take a look. It says Black Ops 4 was pretty much you destroying another team or being destroyed by another team. Is the balanced matchmaking a priority for modern warfare? Yeah, for sure. I mean, one of the things we, we really want to do with this game is we want to we want to get new players in the game and we want them to kind of like, we don't want them to just get punched punched in the mouth over and over again mm -hmm. until they leave. We want a healthy ecosystem. We want a lot of players in and having fun. And that's a that's a big focus for us. It's a big focus for us in weapon design. It's a big focus for us in level design. Um, our weapons are a bit more lethal than uh, they were in, in the Black Ops, the recent more Black Ops. And that helps a, a lower skilled player get a kill when they otherwise wouldn't have some success and then feel like now there's a desire to get better and to get another kill. Uh, our maps are a little bit more por porous, um, and, you know, we want those players to have a, a safe place. To but that uh, that approach that you're discuss describing there isn't going to come at the expense of the hardcore players, right? Um, I don't, that's not the plan, right? But mm -hmm. we want to make sure that we don't want someone who's, uh, how to say this, lower skill to have a bad experience. We're on someone who's higher skill to have a bad experience. We're on someone who's higher skill to have a bad experience. We're on someone who's higher skill to have a bad experience. What the fuck? Well, guys, you heard it right there. You didn't hear it from me. You heard it straight from these developers' mouths, bro. They want to create safe spaces to try and hold good people like me and you, because I assume that you're good if you're watching this video. And if you're not good, it's okay. But majority of the people that probably watch my videos are probably good at Call of Duty. So, like I said, they want to hold us back in order to give Lil Johnny his shot at making the game. Well, at doing well at the game. And that's why I'm playing like this. See? Look. Get out of my safe space. See, look at that. Double Claymore is at the stairs. Got my 725 shotgun, which is still broken. Even after all the freaking nerfs that this thing has received, it's still broken. But no matter. So I'm going to sit here look. Safe space. This is how you got to play the game. Here. See, guys? If you guys want to have fun in this game... Just play like how I'm playing. Oh, but I don't want to play like that. I actually want to rush around. Sorry, little Johnny. You're not gonna, you're not gonna be rushing in this game. I'm telling you right now. You move one little step, and you're dead. All right. You go into any building. There's a claymore waiting for you. And if you think somebody's gonna rush at you with an AR, no. Chances are they're probably rushing at you with this shotgun right here. But it's okay though. Uh, just let me patrol this last little bit right over here. Uh, nothing better than protecting your safe space, man. Because it's not like it's not like they will want us going out there and actually playing Call of Duty for what it is, which is a game about shooting people in the head. And nah, nah, they would just rather us just sit in a room uh, and play and just camp with claymores. Because I think in their minds, that's a little realistic. And don't don't get me wrong. If if Call of Duty was like real life, I'm pretty sure everybody will be camping. Okay, but this is not real life. This is a game. This is something that's made in a computer, and it kind of sucks that we can't have just a little fun with this game. Uh, get out of my safe space. All right, so let me go back over here. Let me come here. Uh, all right, maybe so we got the claymore. I see that one's not set. Let me go ahead and put one right there. Oh, got a guy right here. Safe space. We should make this a hashtag, guys. Hashtag safe space in the comment section below, man. Hashtag safe space, man. I think we really needed to let these developers what they're turning this game into. Like, this game is not fun. Like, you honestly think, developers, are you hearing me right now? Like, 
You really think I want to play like this? Do you really think like this is fun? I mean, yeah, it's fun because I'm getting like a bunch of kills. And look at that. Woo! Got a little personal radar. All right, let's go ahead and reload this. All right, got on my dead silence. By the way, make this thing a perk already. Oh, oh, but Catman, we, we can't make it a perk. Why not, devs? Because pe people will actually be forced to freaking move in this game. Oh, you're right. You're right. That's why. Okay. So, I'm just going to throw this flashbang in here. Is anybody in there? Nope. Okay. I'm going to stay right here. And, and notice, guys, this, this is how you have fun in this game. This is how you have fun. You have to you have to play like this. You have to play like a little wuss. You got to play like it's your first Call of Duty that you ever got. And a lot of people are saying, oh, man, cat, just, just wait for the Christmas noobs. It'll get better during Christmas. Really, to be honest with you, I don't really think this game is going to make it to Christmas if this game is played the way it plays. Like, I heard the overhaul may turn this game into an actual Call of Duty that a lot of people can play. Uh, well, they need to come up with that sooner rather than later because a lot of people, guys, like, the player count for this game is dying really fast. Like, players are fed up, man. I don't think these developers know that if your game is not fun, we're not going to stay around, dude. You don't believe us? Ask Michael Condry. Ask Glenn Schofield. What do we do when none of us enjoy World War II and they don't want to fix none? Okay, fine. We'll just go play Fortnite. We'll make them richer because at least they freaking care about us. Man, these people don't freaking care about us, man. They can care less about this franchise at this point, man. Like, unless Treyarch doesn't do do something next year for Call of Duty 2020, which I'm probably going to make a video out of. I mean, we'll, we'll see. But unless they really do like a 180 of this franchise and just get this franchise back to where it needs to be, I think Call of Duty may be done for. And here's the thing that really freaking sucks, dude. These people have made Call of Duty for how many freaking years now? For like over a freaking decade? And it freaking sucks that we can't get one good Call of Duty on these new gen platforms besides Black Ops 3 and Infinite Warfare. I know I'm in the minority. I actually enjoyed Infinite Warfare. Please don't kill me. Okay. All right. So, yeah. But then we had World War II. Then we had Black Ops 4. And now we got Modern Campfire. No, no, no. Modern Safe Space. That's what I'm going to call it. Not even not even going to put the warfare on it. Modern Safe Space. That's what we're going to call it now. All right. So, anytime somebody says, hey, do, hey, have you played the new Modern Warfare? I'm going to be like, oh, Modern Safe Space. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been playing it right here. Look, look. Look how I'm playing right here. Look at this. Okay. So, nobody's right there. I'm going to check this hallway. Okay. Notice how I've pretty much been in this whole section the whole game because this is how you have to play. Oh, my goodness. Look at this guy. Now I got to make sure I take my safe space back from him. Securing Uh, my goodness. This game had literally so much potential to be great. I don't... I, I thank God these developers are actually dumb enough to actually tell us why this game is the way they is. And you notice how the guy was doing it go, uh, 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 um, uh, yeah, it shouldn't come at the expense of, of hardcore players, because, I mean, I mean, it's not like they want to have fun in the game, too. It's not like they want to play it, but, you know, whatever. So he just, so he just sat there in, in the moment, just... <laughs> I mean, that's why I love making fun of some of these developers, dude. And I swear, man, if these developers don't get this game in check, they're going to be out of here just like Michael and Glenn Schofield, bro. And you know where Michael Conjuring's at right now? He's at freaking 2K, man. <laughs> it's like, yeah, yeah, go, go mess up 2K. Go mess up their game. Don't come over here and mess up our, our game. Don't come over here and mess up our fun. Because, I mean, you, you did it plenty of freaking times. Oh my goodness, and this guy decides that he's gonna pull out this gun. Oh my goodness. Okay, let me rush back over here. Let me see what we got. Okay, so now that I've been kicked out of my safe space, I need a new safe space. So now, oh, hold up, hold up. I think I hear somebody. Somebody's here. Let's put a claymore there. Okay, let's put a claymore there. And I just get shot by the doorway. <laughs> Did you see that guy right there, the glimpse? He was just mounted right there. Like, dude, you cannot move in this game. The only time I move is when I'm in a good old-fashioned safe space. Then I can move. And I'm not really even move moving. I'm just patrolling the doorway, making sure, okay, claymores are all set. Let's put one right here. Let's put one right here. If you guys want to know the perks uh, that I'm running, I'm running, um... Uh, what perks am I running? I'm running uh, Scavenger, 
I'm running, uh, what, 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 what's that perk called? Oh, yeah, the restock, and I'm running shrapnel. Because you got to make sure that you have claymores guarding you at every freaking door. And I know people hate hate the claymores, but guys, I'm, I promise you, uh, I'm trying, I, I really tried to play without claymores. Claymores are a crutch. You need claymores. If you don't have claymores guarding you um, by the door or something, dude, the guy's going to come in and he will freaking kill you. Uh, and as I wait here in my safe space, waiting for my next little target, uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, I got the, got the dead silence popped. Oh, yeah, how dead silence does give you a speed boost. That, that kind of helps just a little. Not a lot, but a little. Um, let's see. Here we go. Uh, oh, shoot. Wait, why am I... And, of course, I get shot. Oh, my goodness. Look at this, man. That gun is freaking broken right there. That MP5. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so now, let's see. A little flashbang. What? Oh, my goodness. I couldn't even get my gun up. Oh my goodness, Infinity War, y'all need to fix the whole ADS thing, like, oh my. like, I think this game is a little too realistic, do any of y'all agree, let me know in the comment section below, is this game a little too realistic, because I feel like, I feel like with Call of Duty, it can look realistic, but it doesn't need to play all realistic, and I know that kind of sounds a little dumb, but, you know, it is what it is, uh oh, okay, I'm camping, camping, Ooh. safe space, get out of my safe space, <laughs> bad experience around someone who's higher skilled to have a bad experience. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it.